Just had some excitement here. Oh, let me get out of here and I'll tell you about it. Man, let's go back here and I'll show you. It is very loud out here with those their caters going crazy. Uh, Waddles, you don't try to don't try to fool me, boy. You got some asking for more treats. So. I was taking this box back here at the fire pit. Right there. Got my new grill. I'll show you that in a minute. And I seen some movement back there in the trees. Right at that tree right there. And out pops a big old black bear. <laughs> and well, I'm just going to tell you my exact words, guys. I'm standing here, I throw the box down, I look up, I see it, I go, oh shit. And uh, the dogs, they always follow me. As soon as Millie seen it, she took off after it. You can see the little little trail they blazed through there. I don't know if you can see it. And to my surprise, Tilly went too. And they chased that bear off. But I got to get out here today. Look how tall this stuff is. And I kind of hate to do it because uh, the bees are enjoying these flowers but if I don't get to this today you know what I may just leave them tell you what I'm gonna leave them this section here plenty of flowers in there for the bees but all this has got to go I want my trails back I gotta keep if I don't get this now it's just gonna be too much uh, especially with this Chinese privet well it ain't coming back Millie I don't think but thank you that's probably what you were hooting at earlier. Yeah. Where's 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 your sister? I don't know. But yeah, if you don't get some of this stuff when it's small, especially these milkweed things, pokeweeds, whatever, uh, they're hard to get down later. So I want to get all this around the house, uh, around the carport, around where the chickens are. They don't like it when I weed eat, do you, Waddles? Yeah. So anyway. I've got my weed eater ready. Let's go look at that grill. Uh, yeah, I'm not going out. <laughs> I'm not going to be out here with a weed eater without protection. So I will have some of that on me. Just in case. Well, that'd be the last thing I'd want to do is have to hurt a bear. But the thing about bears, they're, if they see you, not, I mean, that's probably the fifth time I've seen one on my property. And as soon as they see you, they don't want to tangle with you, especially dogs. And they'll run off or they'll hightail it wherever they were going they don't want any confrontation it's when you run into cubs with a mother where you get in trouble and i think that was a male but i didn't get a real good enough look at it because dogs went after it but it didn't have any cubs and if it did it might have had them laid back now i think if it would have been a mother with cubs it would have come after them dogs too them dogs wouldn't have bothered it but yeah generally a bear they don't want to tangle with dogs especially multiple dogs so all right let's go look at this grill all right went and got a blackstone this is the tailgater uh it's got a griddle on one side i just got done seasoning it then over here it's got the grill went ahead and bought the utensil set there's some pretty nice utensils so we got it all it took me about two hours to put this thing together yesterday uh, you can fold it up roll it around put it on the truck whatever you got to do so, you know, in the summer when you're cooking, it gets a little hot. So that's why I bought a gas grill. I can just come out here, fire it up. Don't have to deal with charcoal. And this charcoal is very expensive right now. Well, it has been for a while. So, you know, you can't afford to cook every day with charcoal. So I got plenty of propane. So we got the old gas grill. I love it so far. Haven't cooked on it yet. Just reheated some steak and uh, a couple of hamburger patties but we'll see how it is all right guys i am not going to record all the weed eating like i've done in the past but i will stop as i get a little bit more done if i see anything interesting oh come on i don't want to try to make the video fun all right just hang in there all right oh got that whole side done on the back of the fence 
not cutting on my grass yet boy that stuff's beautiful too nice and green got around the chickens went and got rooster's yard uh, you guys got your spots in there already all right now i'm fixing to start on this here uh, i went about an hour non-stop yeah it takes a while you, you got to get your body your first you know after about 15 minutes my back my side starts hurting you just got to work through it and then it's good uh oh man these things get louder i think they're moving closer every day i don't know what are you doing tilly where was you you on patrol looking for that old bear i can't believe you went you were yeah you're all gentle i gotta get that bug off you but you got your next guards that's not a bug you guys had 100, 120 a month for tick control here but gotta have it uh as far as the kitchen goes guys on these nice days like this i'm not gonna waste my days inside i'm I, you know i'm not doing stuff just for youtube i'm living you know i live here by myself i live here alone now, I got to keep up with all this stuff, and if I don't, it gets out of hand, and then I lose control. You know, these weeds get six feet tall. Oh, that's twice as hard to do. So, you know, that kitchen, my rainy days, we can work on that now that we got the carport. I'm not concerned with it. I'm just not concerned with it right now. I don't care if it takes a year. But I got other things going, and, and it's a full-time job keeping up with a lot of this stuff. Well, the way I, I could let it go like some people do. But I'm not going to do that. I, I don't like my property to look like that. So, who do you think, Tilly? And I got these guys to take care of. Listen to them. It's, it's like a, I don't know. I don't know what to compare that sound to. Like some kind of machinery running. They're saying, girls, come on, I'm the one, I'm the one. Nope, I'm the one. All right, I'm going to get some more work done. I might record a little bit of it, but... Whew, boy, this stuff's high. All right. Man, this thing here is worth its weight in gold. Oh, I just ran a whole tank out in one shot. Yeah, you can put the blade on this, and it takes down small trees whatnots it's the most expensive one of the most expensive ones i had but you know for several years i did it with just the cheap cheap stills eh, managed but this is a lot easier if you got back problems the strap takes the weight of it off and you know it's good exercise swinging and it, and it holds the weight on this thing right here show you how it hooks up all right, you just, oh, you just take this clip, hook it right there, and all the weight, you know, basically you just pivot it. 15 minutes a day, keeps the doctor away. Well, I might as well use them. They've been sitting in the shed for a year, and there's some 25 pounders in there I think I got. I don't know. Whew. Boy, I've been doing this for about a week. <laughs> the first few days. I was sore. Took a day's rest, then did it again. Took a day's rest. Then I'm doing them about every other day, every day. I don't know, whenever I grab them. Whew, that's enough for today. I was doing them several minutes before I hit record. Uh, man well I got a good good little section done there but uh, I want to finish this section I'm going to push it push it good do, 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 push it good anyway it's usually a three day job and then I'll have to do it again until August. Maybe one in between. I don't know. 
So let's knock all this down amongst the loud noise of the cicadas. Why don't they ever shut up? That, I don't know how I could go outside and sit in a chair and go, ah, all day. I guess they only live a few days, so I'd be complaining too, wouldn't you? I'm not uh, used to this. Uh, I'll come back out here tomorrow, finish all this, and probably get that too. Uh, usually I get this whole section, but I did do it all the way around the house. I did rooster's yard. I did around the chicken yard. So let's go see what them dogs are up to. You never know with them. Let's go. Right, let me show y'all something cool. So I usually buy Skechers and I was due for a new pair. Actually, the old pair hadn't really worn out. They just getting dirty. And I got the, I mean, I wear a size 13. There was only a few choices in what they had, but I like these. And so when I go to put them on, you know, they come out like this. They got the insert. And I'm like, where's, where's the end of the laces, man? <laughs> Fake laces. They're stretchy. You don't have to tie them. Man, I'm sure these been out a while, but I didn't know about them. It's called Skechers Go Walk. Yeah, that is cool. I just hope the laces last as long as the shoe. 
So, yeah, I got to go to the doctor Monday for the foot doctor and other things, and I don't want nasty shoes, so. New ones, but I thought that was pretty cool. Let's go see what these monsters are doing in here. Well, I ain't got a one of them. Well, I ain't got their air conditioner on either. Where's your brother? You like being out in that sun, don't you? Not brother, I'm surprised. Usually if I'm out, he'll be out there. Otherwise, he's in here. You need, I see brother stole your blanket, wadded them both up to make one. She don't care. It's too hot for blankets, boy. It's too hot for blankets. I got your cool machine going. Yeah. You didn't see the bear. Cause you didn't hear the other dogs barking. All right, let's go see what Rooster's doing. Silly girl and boy. Well, you look like you've been up to something. Cause you're usually sleeping. Those are batteries. You, you don't need no batteries. She doesn't never get into nothing or chew things up, just socks. Now Millie, on the other hand, Millie is bad about that. Yeah, she got my hammer, Rooster. Millie tore, tore up the hammer, uh, the handle on my hammer. And you jocked my remote down. You're silly looking. Let's go find your brother or your two sisters. I haven't seen them. Ah, can't find uh, Millie and Tilly. They're out here somewhere. They're probably under the one of the buildings. They like to get under there. Uh, if y'all are new to my channel and you're wondering why I don't mow back there, well, there's just too many rocks. It is nothing, this whole place is nothing but rocks. It's on top of a hill. And I don't know if they, when they leveled for the house that they threw them all over there. I don't know, there's, I've been picking them up for 10 years and I don't think I'll ever be able to mow back there, so. And that's how I've been doing it for 10 solid, well actually probably 8 years because that was all woods back there before. So, but y'all stay tuned. I've got a very interesting next week. Uh, not for you guys, but uh, I got something in the works. And But I'm not going to say nothing until I know what it is. <laughs> well, I know what it is, but if it's a thing or not. I don't know if it's a thing, but if it is... If it does become a thing, I'm going to have a lot of content. And uh, this ain't beans because it hasn't, it's not for sure. I don't know yet. But it may shock you. It's because it's shocking me. But we'll hang on, you know, I'll let you know as soon as I know something. I'm not the kind of guy that if I got something going on, I'm going to tell you, oh, I'm doing this. And then something falls through or whatever and you can't do it. So we'll wait till we can do it. But there's there's some good stuff coming up. Uh, I don't know about projects, but it's going to be some interesting content. So that's all I got for today. And you guys uh, hop on over to the other channel uh, if you want. Check it out. I got videos over there. That channel's doing very well. I appreciate it for those of you who subscribed and who hasn't subscribed and who watch it. Uh, for those that don't know, it doesn't cost a penny to subscribe to a channel. On YouTube that's right it's totally free you just have to you know sign up you sign up with YouTube you subscribe to a channel whoever you like doesn't have to beat me but whoever you like all that does is is keeps track of that channel for you so they're easier to find when they put new videos up and that's it man I, I know a lot of people are you know misunderstand YouTube but that's, it doesn't, doesn't loop you, you know, it doesn't suck you into anything. It doesn't cost you anything. You know, not everybody knows that. So, thanks for watching, guys. We will see you on the next one. Happy trails.